Hello guys, we are back with our next lecture. In this lecture, let us go through the next question. Okay, so this question belongs to Gate CSC 2018, guys. The question is a processor has a 16 integer registers. Okay, so I think why did they give clearly, guys? So they give clearly that those are integer registers only. Okay, so how many are there, guys? 16. So indirectly, it is as if it is 16, we need four bits to represent these, right? Yes. Coming to the next part and 64 floating point. Okay, so they even give floating point registers also. So it is a nothing but a six, right? So it is a two bar six is nothing but 64. So six bits we need. Okay. So it it uses a two byte instruction format. Okay. Okay. So there are four category instructions: type one, type two, type three, and type four. Okay. So type one category consists of four instructions, each with three integers. Okay, three R's. Okay, okay, okay. So this R means it is they are saying it is an integer type. Okay, and the type two category contains eight instructions, each with the two floating points. Okay, type three contains four fourteen instructions, each of one integer operand and one float operand. Okay, type four category consists of n instructions, each with a floating point one F. Okay, so I think this question is a bit of a different type of question, guys. So basically, normally instructions are this much length, right? Yes. So I'm just giving an example, okay? Yes. So these instructions are further, they are dividing into four different categories, guys. We will understand what is the exact length later on, so don't worry, okay? So they are saying, sorry. So they are saying the first type is a type 1. So I'll be writing one below the other, guys. So type 1, okay? So they are saying type 1 is having four instructions, so let me draw it in this way. So the instructions are four. So how many bits I need opcode guys? I need two bits opcode. So I'll be writing OP for opcode. Similarly, what about a type two guys? So let me draw the same sizes so that we can easily identify what is the exact question. Okay. Yes, opcode, opcode and opcode. Okay. Moving on, uh, second type category contains eight instructions. Okay, so it's also, so I forgot to write here, so it is a 2 and if it is 8 instructions, it exactly takes 3 bits. Okay, moving on, type 3 category contains of a 14. Okay, so I think this 14 is a bit skeptical, right? Because every time he is giving normal values, but here he gave 14. Okay, so for now, let us take it as a 14 means, let us take 4 bits for now, but let us keep an arrow here to keep an eye on it, guys. Okay, yes, so let us continue. So type 4, what about type 4? Type 4 category consists of n instructions. Okay, so they are saying how many instructions are there? They are not saying the exact value guys. So this instructions are n. So means that this base will, this log, this bits value will be log base 2 of n, right? Yes, okay. So till now it is clear. Okay, so in instruction 1, they are saying 4 integer, sorry, 4 integers are there. So r, r, r. And each of it is a 4 byte register. Okay. Similarly, in R2, there are two floating point and each floating point is a 6 bits. Nice. What about T3? T3 or I3 instruction, I3. So anything, guys. So I, I wrote in terms of type 3. Okay. Yes. So it is a combination of 1 R and 1 F. So it is a 4 plus a 6. Similarly, the last one is having only single float and it is of a 6. Right? Yes. Okay, so did they give what is the type of the address guys here? Yeah, they clearly gave it is a 2 byte addressable. So the maximum length is a 16 indirectly, right? Yes, and now what they are exactly asking is the value of a n. Okay, so I think this is a type of interesting question and this question seems to be like in computer networks we will be having these type of questions guys. In uh, IPs, in IP addressing we will be having these type of questions. Okay, So first of all let us identify how many bits here guys are covered. So it is a nothing but a 14 bits is a this length. Okay, similarly this is a 12 plus, this is also 14 bits. This keep it aside guys for now because it is having 14 bits, right? Sorry, 14 numbers only instructions. So basically here how many numbers we are indirectly wasting guys. So until 16. So two numbers are indirectly being wasted here, right? Okay. Yes, that's true. So, so let us keep it aside for now. And the last one we don't know exactly. So it is a nothing but 6 plus 4 that is a 10 plus a something and this is a 6 plus x got it yes okay so i think uh, this question is a bit interesting right okay 
ओके सो एनी वे सो द टोटल लेंथ सो बेसिकली इफ आई एड दिस टोटल लाइक ऑल द कॉम्बिनेशन आई शुड गेट द मैक्सिम पॉसिबल कॉम्बिनेशन आर टू पार सिक्सटीन राइट यस ओके सो लेट अस कंटिन्यू ओके सो देर इज अ स्मॉल ट्रिक वाइल कैलकुलेटिंग दिस टाइप ऑफ क्वेश्चन गाइज ओके सो द थिंग हियर इज ओके सॉरी जस्ट गिव मी सेकेंड सो इट इज सिक्स प्लस सिक्स प्लस थ्री राइट सो इट इज फिफ्टीन माई बैड ओके यस ओके सो आई थिंक इफ वी कैलकुलेट दीज वैल्यूज इट विल बी ए बिट ईजी राइट और शेल वी डू इन दिस वे ऑन डे आई डोंट थिंक सो इट विल बी दैट मच ईजी इफ वी डायरेक्ट ट्राइ टू सॉल्व सो द फर्स्ट वैल्यू इज अ टू पवर सिक्सटीन राइट सो द वैल्यू द टोटल इंस्ट्रक्शन और टोटल डिफरेंट डिफरेंट नंबर possible is a 65535 guys so from that we clearly know that instruction one type are 2 power 14 okay so it is a nothing but so i'll be writing these values here so 16 384 similarly 2 power 15 the other value okay so that is a nothing but 32 768 the total is a plus 16384 That is a nothing, but the total is a forty-nine thousand one fifty-two, guys. So if I subtract forty-nine thousand one fifty-two, okay. So I will be directly subtracting here only. The answer will be negative, but I'll be making it into positive. So don't worry. Thirty-six. The final answer is a sixteen three eighty-four. Okay. So few students will be like, okay. So why are you doing all these things? We know few tricks sir, to solve these type of things. Sir. So few students will be saying like, okay. So we want to subtract two power sixteen minus two power fifteen. Minus two power fourteen, right? So they will be saying like, so just to convert this into two power fifteen. So two into two power fifteen minus one minus sorry minus two uh, power fifteen minus two power fourteen, right? So in this thing they will be saying that take common two power fifteen can be taken common, right? So it is two minus one, right? Yes. So the final result will be two power fifteen minus two power fourteen. The same concept here also. So the end result will be two power fourteen. So in that way also fusions will be there to calculate that. So the same result you will be getting any way, guys. Got it? Yes. So I solved the both the ways, guys. I know even that way, right? Yes. Okay. So now the left out instructions are sixteen three eighty four, guys. Okay. So they we know clearly how many instructions are left. So here we exactly know how many are instructions which are used, right? So it is exactly fourteen. So I think we can directly calculate how many are they, guys, indirectly. So it is a nothing but a two power ten, right? So this part, okay. So two power ten into sorry, not in power. If you are right below, okay, into fourteen. So this will be the total count of these bits, guys. Okay. So that is a nothing but a fourteen three three six. So fourteen three three six is the value here. So if I subtract sixteen three eighty four minus fourteen three three six, I will be ending up with two zero four eight number of left out bits, guys. So if you observe carefully, what is the log value for this, guys? Okay. So if you recall, what is the log value of that? It is nothing but eleven, I think. So so let me just cross check it. Two zero four eight. Sorry. Yes, it's eleven. So basically, you can at max go up to eleven bits, guys. Okay. So at max you can go up to eleven bits. Means so six plus x equal to eleven. Sorry, the value of x is eleven minus six, right? So the x value could be five. So at max, how much could be the value of y? So here, what they are asking, they are asking the value of y. I got the value of this. So this is nothing but a two power this value, right? So two power five is a thirty-two. So at max, thirty-two instructions can be made, right? Yes. So it's a quite good question, guys. If you ask me, because here in this question. This is a concept. So basically, I have solved these type of things, right? So these are things we will be learning in computer networks, guys. So in a networks like that is the next subject. So don't worry. So in that you will understand how I was able to solve this question really easily and fastly, right? Yes. So now you got an idea, right? So how exactly we have solved it? Okay. So in the next lecture, let us continue with the next question. And whenever solving these type of questions, always concentrate on given inputs, guys. So instead of this, if I took a four here. So it will become fourteen, right? And there will be no bits left out. So because of those two bits left out, only we got this one zero two four instructions left out. Got it? Yes. So now you got an idea, right? So how exactly to solve a question? Okay. So in the next lecture, let us continue with the next question. Thank you. Thanks for watching. Like, share, and subscribe for more awesome videos like this. Thank you.